Now, the government is calling on investors to take advantage of investment opportunities presented by the Konza Technopolis that has been termed as a regional model of building cities. ICT Cabinet Secretary Joe Mosheru says the data center at Konza City is now ready to host government and private sector data needs. Kwanza Technopolis has attracted over 40 firms that had applied to establish investments in technological ventures. So far, more than 40% of the 145 parcels under phase one of the project had already been taken up. Those who have already taken up space at Konza include South African Specialized Hospital, an American hospital, software development companies, real estate developers, hotel and residential houses. The ICT ministry is calling on investors to tap opportunities at the Konza city. Globally, many new technologies have come up on how to build, how to manage cities and ensure that those cities are smart. Konza is the showcase for our region, for our country, for everyone to see how we can be able to implement this effectively, efficiently, and really improve the quality of lives of Kenyans. Mm -hmm. And so I would encourage everyone to go to Konza. The Technopolis is anchored on three main clusters, which are IT, IT-enabled services, engineering, and life sciences. As a special economic zone, the Technopolis ranks high in the ease of doing business due to incentives by the government. The National Data Center, located at Konza Technopolis, is now ready to host government and private sector data needs. The Ministry has exuded confidence that the state-of-the-art facility will be of great benefit, especially for government agencies. We have uh, a tier 3 data center which according to international standards, we are actually a data center that should be 99.99% available every other time. So we really welcome many more agencies to come on board and actually very soon we are preparing a policy to try and encourage as many other government agencies. Konza City and the county governments of Kajiado, Machakos and Makweni have established a team to guide developments within a 10-kilometer buffer zone of the Technopolis. Betty Kiptum, Channel 1 Business.